firefighters hoped to be able to make progress Sunday on the deadliest series of wildfires in California history, as the grim task of finding those killed continued. The winds that bedeviled firefighters Saturday are expected to die down Sunday, allowing firefighters to go back on the offense after a day of new evacuations. The death toll from the fires has now hit 40 but officials believe that number will rise as searchers make their way through the neighborhoods in Santa Rosa that burned down as well as mountain communities across wine country. It's delicate, sensitive work. On Saturday, more than two dozen law enforcement officials converged in Santa Rosa's Fountain Grove neighborhood, along a street where every home had been destroyed. Two officers opened the trunk of their patrol car, retrieved a drone and launched it above the wreckage. The drone hovered above the crumbling walls and destroyed homes, slowly rotating in midair. Later, two officers stepped into the crumbling remains of a garage, where the burned-out shell of a car was barely visible from a distance. One officer knelt next to the vehicle, and began delicately handing fragments from the scene to his partner. Officials with the Sonoma County Sheriff's Office later confirmed that one of two additional deaths reported Saturday had been found in Fountain Grove, but did not say where.